Okay, well, this is Pipe Man Dan. Coming to you from Northwest Ohio. On March 10th, 2022. At about 12.30 p.m. It's 40 some degrees out. Kind of beautiful, actually. It's going to be pretty much my first video. Yeah, my first video for just a white TPC. I'm not doing a VR, so. But I was just doing a VR about two hours ago for um, hiking pipes. Craig. And then I did one for uh, Ed at Armchair Piper. And um, while I was doing the one for uh, Craig, or right before I did the one for Craig, actually, I got a box in the mail. So I figured I'd do a little yabo, I guess. Real quick. And, um, real quick, because it, it, I cannot believe how those last two VRs that I did, it's like, it's so hard to believe how fast 15 minutes can go by. I figured that they'd be like nine minutes and then I'm uploading them and it's like 14 minutes for one, 18 for the other. And Twitch, if you're listening, Ed or Craig, I'm sorry about them being so long. I wasn't really expecting that. But this one will not be that long. All right, so. I'm smoking uh, some Hearth and Home Port Swing that I bought like everything else pretty much back in 2018. <laughs> You'll hear me say that about a million times because that's when all my tobacco's from. <clears throat> and I'm smoking it in a, a 7 uh Roma Lucite 611KS. And I'm drinking some black coffee with it. Without bourbon this time. So anyways. Let's get right to it. This is from... and C fulfillment pipes and cigars I guess Okay, so I've been watching uh, Spurgeon Piper and some other ones that have that were talking about how good Chelsea Morning is. So I went ahead and ordered some Chelsea Morning GLPs. Um, I figured I'd give that a try. And then um, Spurgeon Piper, I think it's two favorite right now, or Stonehenge and maybe that Chelsea Morning. So I got some Stonehenge. GLPs also. Give that a try because I don't have either one of those. And then, um, who turned me on to this? Mm, I think it was probably uh, Giannis at Pipe, Pipes and Tobacco. I think he was smoking this and said how good it was. The H&H &H Rustica. So I got two tins of that. I have a lot of H&H &H tobacco. Like a pound, a pound of old dark fire, a pound of um, dark Virginia and then a few of these tins of like pure Virginia and stuff but I don't have I didn't have rustica so now I do and then uh, well another stone hinge and then the last thing is Gallatin and Hogarth dark flake a blend of dark fired Virginias and Indian fire cured tobaccos. I didn't do any reviews on this, I don't think, but um, 
I saw it on there, so I decided to get it. There's only like one left. So, I guess that's pretty much my first video just for the YTPC. I did kind of an introduction when I did um, my VR to uh, Pipes and Toback. But, I mean, if you want to know more, you can let me know, but. Uh, anyways, you guys have a good one.